All right, here we are in the shop. Where to start? I think we should start with this. I think it's kind of one of the first problems that we were having. Now I got to the bottom of it. I know what happened. Uh, to take this off, all you need is a Phillips screwdriver. One that you can spin like that works handy. And this comes off real easy. Now this is, <clears throat> excuse me, this is a pretty cool uh, setup here. Old school, I guess. Now it looks like a 130 or 180 motor. They rigged up somehow to be the steering, one one way uh, steering servo. Two two way. Yeah, it's just a motor. It looks like a 130. It looks it looks like a 180 from right there, but it's probably a 130. And here's our RS380, and here's our ESC, got the resistors, um, yeah, wow, <laughs> it's all uh, all plastic gears, we're, we're running another, uh, they call these two level, uh, two level spur gears, you have your, your big gear, and then the smaller gear there, and it, it kind of, I don't know, it's supposed to reduce shock and, you know, it, instead of having this to one big gear, it kind of, it's a little reduction, so that it, it le lessens the, lessens the forces, physics, but uh, that's it. What we had going on with the clicking noise. Now this is going to be fun to mess with, it's a pretty simple platform. There's our motor, motor plate. So that'll be easy to swap the motor. Little rinky dink pinion. And here's our spur shaft running up to the front. Pretty common like most. No bearings, it's all plastic. Kind of little bushings it rides on. But this is that. At least it's that uh, that good white kind of vinyl. It's pretty durable. This is what that spur gear in the Hosen 9125 was made. Same kind of material. It was not bad. And here's our differentials. This is really goofy. I don't know. Oh, you can see. So that little two two level spins that. And that spins the spider gears in there. And the front, kind of the same. Now, what was making the noise, I called it, is some uh, little bits of sand. Just little, see the little bits of sand in there? I took a screwdriver and cleaned it out and it's been smooth. So, we'll wrap this up. And on to the next.